Okay, this is instructions on how to replace a stainless steel float switch. And the first thing to, to notice is if there's a groove here. Let's see if we can zoom in. If there's a groove, then we'll use an E-clip. Uh, an E-clip like that. If there's no groove, then we'll use a, a compression or a spring clip like this. So we'll deal with the, uh, the E-clip first. And it's a simple matter of pressing it on. Some movement there, that's no good. So we're gonna push it down a little bit more. There. So <clears throat> that's a secure E-clip. Oh, actually, I might as well <clears throat> demonstrate how to turn this off at, at the same time, or how to pull this off. So it's just a quick, sharp tug and off it comes. If we want to put on a spring clip instead, there's a spring clip already on the expanding pliers. Actually, we'll demonstrate. So when you squeeze, they expand. And what we'll do is just expand it. And now the spring clip is in position. That's it. Stop. 